suggestion for you. I would recommend the strawberry sprinkle. Oh, for God's sake, the selection isn't even that big to begin with. You could get chocolates, raisins, candy, or any combination of the three. Or, or maybe all three at once. Just pick something. Um, I'm just going to assume that you were asking how someone like me could eat anything in the first place. Well, it's none of your concern, obviously. You should be directing that question over at 2.5D guy over there. Me? Yes, you. How does, well, anything get through your system, being as thick as a human child's book? It's not all that different from regular people. I don't understand why everyone thinks my bodily structure is completely different just because I'm not as fleshed out as everyone else. You know what? That's very fascinating. But hold that thought for a sec. Look at my bestest best friend in the whole world. Did you even find my hat yet? Well, not yet. Not yet. You know I'm waiting in line. That's the line. And you're just stumbling around the city. What? We're having a bloody fantastic time. That hat was a gift from the space gods. We can't lose it, okay? You were the one checking out me. Whatever. Look, I haven't found it yet, but there are going to be a couple of people around here who claim to be hat aficionados. Brilliant. Check them out. See if they've got my hat. I'll let you know if MGS4D Guns of the Patriots SOP edition is any good. Wow. That's uh... a long time. Yeah, a bit longer. Honestly, did you know that the longest Next. Ever was not the best of the dawn? Of Come the on, move up already. Quit holding up the line. And I've got to go now. Good evening. Uh, I'm looking for a blue hat with a radio tower on it. Ring any bells? Okay, no help at all. How joyous. <laughs> Sorry, ma'am. I had uh, those off. Okay, then. Sorry about the whole no oh. help bit. It's fine, it's fine. Anyway, I remember seeing something like that nearby the gas station. There was also some big guy walking around with it, I think. Gas station. Got it. Thank you, Verily, kind sir. Hey, Verily? Do you think she knows we are not in the Renaissance era anymore? Nah! Our superiors ordered us to provide the UN investigators with intel. Psst! But I didn't know it was you. Uh, what? Colonel. What time is it? It's the exact same time Don't as when you asked earlier, and it'll him. be the exact same time when you ask later. I swear this movie was supposed to be 4D. But it isn't 4D! Uh, you Can you not smell it. the blood and gunpowder? Well, Clearly these actors know how to challenge! It kinda reminds me of this last time I was in my adventure. I was fighting in the stratosphere trying to destroy a giant mob. <laughs> Whoa! That acting this women threw the chair at me! Whoa! Oh, melodrama. <laughs> Clearly, very overrated. Asking for a challenge! Sweet Celestia, is that man going to be alright? I already called an ambulance for the poor guy. But he should be fine as long as he keeps himself together. I certainly hope so. So, um, Forget have you seen anyone wear a blue hat with a radio tower? Hey! Eh? Um, alright, are you listening? Okay. <laughs> Come on, tough guy! Bring it! Rear, 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 rear! <laughs> Get over there! Didn't care! Dad, Dad! He's right. They were heading towards the hotel in front of that KFC. Hello? Anyone in there? Hello? Yes, we are connected. And before you ask, yes, I almost have your hat. It's near the hotel in front of the KFC. For nothing. What was that thought? I'm an invisible. Either use your radar to pick up their tracks. I'm not a moron. Members are most likely to be found. 
unbelievable. It's still that good? No, unbelievably realistic. I couldn't believe my eye. Honestly, it's, it's like, it's more than four digits, you know? It's like five digits. SHUT UP! And just now, some poor little girl up there got tranquilized. I'll be honest, that was more of a godsend than a problem. How long do these things last? Who cares? He's not talking. Touché. Anyway, the sooner you find my hat, the quicker we can go home and try out a new cookbook that I downloaded from a kind movie girl. You just accepted some guy's file? What? He had a white chef hat. Absolutely legit. So, yeah, I'll cook tonight, and I won't take no for an answer. Now head off and get my hat. The good bit's about to start. I think. Hey, let this water sleep. He's been coming here for months, asking for the same thing. At least he pays well, though, but no. Oh, my. You're Luigi. I'm such a big fan. I love your new 3DS game. Yeah, I'm a Luigi number one. What the f*** do you want to drink? Um, you don't seem as cheery as you normally do in the games. Oh, really? <laughs> well, sorry to disappoint you, but when you're getting shafted by tending bar to a bunch of fat, drunken slobs, while your big brother, the famous ever so awesome brother, is out there having another awesome adventure and getting rewarded again with cake and gold and some other sh like that, you wouldn't be so sunshine and lollipop. <laughs> Eh, forget it. I should be grateful anyway. Honestly, this is nothing compared to my old job. Do tell. Ah. And what would you like for Christmas, little boy? I don't want to talk about it. So yeah, just let him sleep. I'm honestly hoping he doesn't wake up ready to puke again. had problems. I could write an essay on the hell this poor guy has gone through. So you're down in the slum store, huh? Darn. Let me get you something. On the house. I you are of legal age, right? <laughs> of course. <laughs> I have lived for over millennia. <laughs> I'll take you out. So what's been eating ya? Well, I have this roommate who's pretty much a self-entitled idiot. No. And he's having me go all over the damn city looking for his no, sir. Can't you just buy another one? It's... A very rare hat. Use Simple Minded is in his programming. Programming? He is a robot boss. But if I could, I would indeed tweak his coding in a heartbeat. Whoa, slow down there. I'm pretty sure you don't want to go stumbling out there drunk in the dark. Kind sir, I am a magical alicorn. I would not be able to get drunk regardless of how hard I tried. Hey, look at me! Oh, sorry kid, you gotta be 21 or over to drink. Unless you want the uh, juice or something. Oh, couldn't you just let me try a little? Wheatley's hat. Little bear, how did you get that hat? Oh, this? I found it rolling out of a bathroom. Bathroom? grasp the concept of proper battery life these days. Honestly, I think a potato battery could hold better charge than this. Oh, I know I'm missing something, but what? That hat belongs to my acquaintance, and he wants it back. <laughs> no. Find his keepers, lady. This is not up for discussion. I don't care what you think. This hat is mine! Wow, that's good. Hey, that brat's always asking for a shot. She's probably gonna run back to that big mall in the lower district as usual. I know that mall. I shall cut her off there. 
Uh, I hate drunken wretches. So, um, the movie. Unexpected twists galore, right? Huh? Yeah, sure. Whatever. Now look. I could have used less live rounds, though, I feel. You know, I mean, there's authenticity, and then there's insane measures. Bigger than you fear, buddy. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Hope I didn't disturb you too much, then. I was just polishing my book museum, you know, when it occurred- Look, you a stupid ball! Unless you're planning on getting a movie room, mind your own business! Well, if you wanted to talk about that, you could have just said something. Hinted at it, at minimum. Ooh. Well then, come with me. I've got something that'll definitely match your needs. So, 7.6 for us are out, son. Fine there, Corinthian leather layout. Amazing 4K resolution! Do we got a deal, Metaball? Uh, I'm not completely sure, to be honest. I mean, I, I don't recall Luna being interested in a home theatre system. How about I throw in this free bird toy for you? <laughs> oh, good man. Where do I sign? <laughs> Just sign here. Well, uh, mm, that's a lot of zeros. Uh, oh, wait. I'm not upside down. Though I don't recall Sense having that many zeros. Are you mental? Okay, now this is an honest question because you can't be serious with a price like this. <laughs> Did your possibly adopted parents not teach you the value of human currency? Sir, are you aware that you need a legitimate license and evidential permissive rights to solicit in this establishment? Uh, uh, quick question. If he does turn out to be a fake salesman, could I take him to court? Wait, what if this hurts? What if this really hurts? Ah, oh, I did- oh! Hmm, where's that scuba guy? I heard his footprints going here. Mr. Lovett does not seem to be interested right now. <laughs> about this hat. Your friend sounded like a complete jerk. It doesn't seem worth it, right? I am not one to let my personal vendetta get in the way of something as simple as getting back a hat. Speaking of which... Aha! Diane speaks of bearing my child. I am given pause. <laughs> Until now, I had never considered my legacy. Perhaps... Relinquish the hat this instant, little bear. Give me 
not end well. talking, but that yellow guy at the theatre couldn't. Universal Translator A season for all things. A time to live and a time to die. A time to build. Get him out of here! And a time to destroy! <laughs> oh, he's gone. Where did you send him? Uh, no clue. That big daddy's talking pretty good. So for a bit, my magic won't be as accurate as I would like it. Point is, he is gone. We should all get going. Inc oh, she seemed eager to leave. Let's go home now. I need some time to rest. Or else we could... Oh, come on, we're going back to the moon. We can clearly see it outside now, so let's get going, please. Wait a minute. Since when did the moon rain? It doesn't. I told you something like this would happen. Let's just head back in the morning. Okay, fair enough. You know, GLaDOS always berated the test subjects on how they found any form of weather to be artistic. Especially rain and snow. They didn't care much though. I mean, they had a point. Sort of. Oh, looks like my hat's still in peak condition. A little bit of animal hair, though. Do you think it needs to be tailored or something? You know, give it the old spit shine. <laughs> uh, do humans still say that? Go to bed, Wheatley. Or shut down. Or whatever it is he spears to. Just shut up. I just wanted to devour the tendons with you. Something to brighten the mood. The saying is chew the fat, and I do not want to. I am trying to rest from walking all over the city and being smacked by a massive drill just because I needed to get your stupid hat back. Oh, okay. Well... And you never even thanked me. Do you realize what you are? Selfish. All you have been trying to do is boss me around. Am I getting through to you now? You know what you are? Selfish. I've done nothing but sacrifice to get us here. And what have you sacrificed? Nothing. Zero. I... Uh, I don't blame you. <laughs> and honestly, I, I do thank you for getting my hat back. Will you please stop peeping over there? Sorry, sorry. Just had to delete that e-cookbook. It turns out it was a virus. Or a poor man's attempt at one, anyway. It takes more than a simple virus to make an aperture-made creation go haywire. <laughs> thank you very much. Wait. You thanked me. And you decided to delete a virus. Yeah, and? They were good decisions. Didn't you say you were programmed to make terrible ones? Were, my dear. <laughs> you know, when you're left out in space with nothing to do but float around, you have a lot of time to reflect on what you've done. Not been at all. A disruptor, a hacker, a tyrant, and eventually... Grab me, grab me, grab me, grab me! Space debris. I couldn't change at the time because, well, one, it's in my programming, and two, when you're in the moment, everything else is null and void to you. You're so into it, you know? 
it clouds your judgement. Big time. I wish I could change who I was. Honestly, I, I really do. But I have no permanent control over it. Not unless someone else reworks me for the better. <laughs> I'm sorry about all this. I really am. I'll just leave you to your thoughts then. What are you doing? What? At least you're trying, and I thank you for that. Ah, oh, bless your little heart. This new world is sufficient enough for our victory. I mean, our legends. Even if the art style's a bit tacky. Honestly, it's a breath of fresh air from all the realistic emphasizing from the last world. Indeed. Still, I'm surprised how well the legends handle that massive Unipro. Well, mostly. We can't let it happen again. I hope you have some sort of plan just in case they return. <laughs> Relax, my dear. Provided the shield is as fortified as I imagined, the Unipro should be kept at bay this time. Besides, we have other things to worry about. Like preparing this new level? And the Ledger themselves, of course. Not the oblivious ones like Jay or Star, but the likes of Leo and Alex. They're probably trying to put the pieces together and, well, <laughs> it's much too early for that. Understandable, sir. Um, Game Master. Hmm? What troubles you? N never mind. It seemed like a pointless thought anyway. Well, it's good that you retracted your question instead of wasting my time. Now get to the control deck. We have to prep this level for our legends. I've waited far too long for this moment.